Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to Elden Ring and Side Quest. It's a big day today. I have many plans. We have a lot of stuff to check up on and look into. First of which is... I noticed in coming back here... Someone's missing. And that concerns me a little. They concern me a little all the time, but I prefer knowing where they are. Um, do you have any explanation for... I feel like this is your job, knowing where Ymir is. So, like, where is he? Enough of you. That doesn't feel like an answer to my question. Have you looked back there? In the last five minutes? You should. I feel like you'll be very interested. Um... Hello? Where is he? Wait. Examine. Um... Oh. What? 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 I didn't even see a button there. Whoa. Well, plans for the day cancelled. This is much more important. I am still... I am still very, very, very... wondering what on earth he is talking about with the mysterious boy in here, which I should watch my step to avoid stepping on, I guess. I just... I'm so confused. Maybe if we go downstairs, I'll find out more, but I... That feels like a hint that there's... someone sneaky else in this big place. But I sure haven't seen anything. Hmm. Hello? Anyone? Anything? At all? Hmm. Forgive me. What? I failed you. Failed to birth you whole. I was not ready to be your mother, but I can still stay here. Nice and close. For now, my dear. Sleep soundly. Um. Not to intrude, but what's going on? Um. Hello? I will return shortly. Please, allow the two of us a moment alone. Sure, that's... I will return, please. You got it. I have things to look into before you get back there anyway. Maybe if we are quick about it, um... Okay, no, just, just... Candle stand. My eyes are playing tricks on me now. I'm seeing potential... Things, objects, people, whatever's... All over the place now. What is this? I definitely did not expect it here. Gracious. Another one? This all just gets more and more sketchy. I do not trust this guy. Finger Ruins of Mir. I do not trust this guy. Sword Hand of Night, Anna. Oh. Hello. Um. 
I guess I am intruding, so... Wow. This is reasonable. Explosions! Kabooms! Really shutting you down here. Claws of Night. Cool. I feel like I'm going to be a lot less welcome upstairs as soon as I, um... Get back up there, but... Frankly, this needs looking into, because it... Is only confirming that... That guy up there is not to be trusted. I guess I might as well that this is also concerning. <laughs> that there is one of these and these. Oh boy. Well. Too late to go back now. Oh. Can't interact with this one. At least not yet. Surprising. Would have thought that, um... Huh, what do you know? Hmm. Well, I guess let's go back up. But I'm not expecting a warm welcome up there. I hear something. And someone. Finger Weaver's cookbook. A record of crafting techniques left by a determined student of the Finger Ruins. His brush with a sublime all but shattered his mind, though he was left capable enough to leave these few precious words. Fingerprint Nostrum. Whatever that is. Uh, then there's these. Claws of a bottomless black from which no light can escape. Wielded by Anna, sword hand of night. Engraved with a smith script, enabling strong attack to launch all three claws at a target. The blades are only semi-corporeal and cannot be fully guarded against. Wow. Employing smithing arts to conjure multiple copies of the armament in both hands and throw them all at once. Follow up with an additional input to throw again. Very cool. Sounds very... Yeah, extremely dexterous. <laughs> cool weapon. What's the new thing we can make? There. Boosts mind, intelligence, faith, and arcane at cost of gradual HP loss. Wow. Neat. A bolus engraved with whorl like lines. A secret medicine of those who attempt to turn their human bodies into fingers. Ingesting causes something to wriggle within. Not loving a lot about this. About all this. So one of the knights that Jolan belongs with attacked us down here, and I expect we're going to get a similar treatment upstairs. Unless we can manage to be very, very sneaky on the return. I am not optimistic on that one. Boy, oh boy. This was not what I had planned for today. So, um... Hello? Are we good? All cool? No one saw this? Um... I 
I'm just going to casually walk out as if nothing happened. Although I guess we could chat. Enough of you. Tell her you were attacked by a sword hand of night underground. Um, that would require admitting we were underground. Hmm. I'm torn. Saying nothing feels like the thing to do to protect oneself and maybe enable continuing to have interactions with these people for a bit longer. This feels like the... This feels more like actually advancing things forward rather than putting a halt to progress of a sort on this little NPC quest line, but progress of a sort seems like it's just going to go to hostilities immediately. Uh, one way or another, let's find out. Stop. What did you just say? <sighs> Wait, no. Say nothing. I have one star alone, and only his words will do. Well, you took that relatively well. I'm glad. I will say this much. I am in your debt, but I will hear no more. I have one star alone, and only his words will do. Well, okay. That works. Um... Just to see... Let's... Park. And then... Try to read the room. A little bit. Um... So... Before I go over there, what sort of mood is he in? Be on your way. I will hear no more about this. Okay, well, I'll, I'll just go check myself. So... How's it going? I didn't do it. Hmm. Did you espy something unsightly? Perchance? Well, put it out of your mind. The stars will reveal the truth in time. Free yourself of any misconceptions, lest they bring woe upon the both of us. Huh. You are also taking this relatively well. Oh, hello. Is something the matter? So much is the matter, but... The fact that you're being chill, I guess, is some relief. I don't remember if you were selling these before. These, uh, particular magical techniques. A glintstone sorcery of Count Emir, High Priest. One of the finger sorceries said to have been discovered in a hallowed ruin. Flings a magic nail that crumbles during flight. Charging increases potency. County Mir boasts that this is mere child's play, an echo of a greater truth. What of this one? County Mir boasts also child's play. I see. Well. Not that I can, like, use these, but... I'll add them to the collection. Why not? Well, good talking. May the gleaming stars guide you evermore. And you as well. Please explain the boy thing to me at some point. Maybe the boy is the deceased one out here that he visited overnight, but... Like, maybe that's the case. Maybe that's the- that also kind of tracks with the watch your step thing. If this is the boy, then, like, watch your step in the graveyard. Don't want to disrupt the grave. Yuri, beloved child, taken before his time. 
I choose to believe that this is the answer because it is a answer and far less weird. Now, where were we? Things to do. Let us put this place out of our minds for a little bit, as we were advised. <laughs> I think it's best for all of us. First thing that we need to kind of... I don't even know if it's a thing we need to do, but uh, I did go back after last episode and try to see what it was that popped up on screen ever so briefly. And, uh... Hang on, what was the exact text? Right, right, okay. It says, Somewhere a great rune has broken and also a powerful charm. Which is interesting. It... It's possible that that is just some other new multiplayer feature type thing, kind of like when rune holders were uh, defeated in the base game and that give you, gave you that kind of like glittery particle effect in the sky that meant that everyone was like, everybody else on that group password would get bonus runes for defeating enemies for a short little while. That usually didn't come with, like, that kind of text box pop-up, though. This felt different and more unique, and I don't know what it means, but I want to now go and check in with everybody, NPCs-wise, because... I don't know. Nothing may be different, but that felt potentially important, or at the very least strange, and I don't want to take chances, so let's do a quick... Let's do a quick run back through all the NPC locations. Freya, have you moved? No, of course you haven't moved. Oh, there you are. Good. If you happen to see Lady Leda, tell her that I'm striking out on my own. Oh. Don't worry. I've no mind to cross any of you. The guidance of kind Mikola remains etched into my very flesh. It's only... There's something that I must know. Um, what do you intend to look into? Kindly Mikola spoke of the vow he once made with General Radan, and it is here the vow shall be honored. I am a Redmane. I must know the nature of the vow. Makes sense to me. I'm just glad you have something new to contribute. I'll be out on my own for some time. There's something I must know. Um, what if you become our enemy? I mean, I'd, I'd prefer that not be the case, but what if that? There is no need for concern. I will be true to my word. Though I do feel a hint of regret, Lady Leda and Honorable Ansbach are of a special breed. How glorious it would have been had we met in battle as sworn enemies. Yeah, no, I'm sure it would have ruled. Um, so is that it? I'll be out on my own for some time. There's something I'm... All right, cool. Well, good luck to you. Hope to bump into you out on the road. And I assume that if I were to rest, you leave. Yep. Well, seems this was a good idea. Um, next stop, I guess. Hey, fellas, so, like, a weird thing happened in the sky, and I don't really know what, but, um, I'd like your thoughts. Kindly Mikola has discarded his great rune. Ah. The fog that vexed my aging faculties has been lifted, and follies better left forgotten haunt me once again. <sighs> once, in an attempt to free Lord Moog from his enchantment, I challenged tender Mikola. Only to have my own heart rather artfully stolen. I knew not how weak I was. I believed that with sufficient mastery, even an Empyrean would be within reach of my blade. I could not have been more mistaken. Mikola the Kind is a monster, pure and radiant. He wields love to shrive clean the hearts of men. There is nothing more terrifying. That is... What I suspected was happening here. I kind of, well, okay, it's not exactly what I was suspecting was happening with you, specifically. I, I seem to have been at least partially incorrect about that, but I was wondering. There was something with the language uh, that Leda kept on using about 
she and all the rest out here being compelled to follow and uh, like other uh, other language that you could take to mean or to be sort of like a subtle subtextual implication that these people were not out here necessarily following Mikola's path of their own will, that they were being manipulated somehow. And there are other descriptions, There are there's at least one other description, and maybe I brought this up in a previous episode, uh, but just in case, it, it seems increasingly important. There was a description from the base game that also kind of hinted at this possible angle on Mikola's character as being as being like a master manipulator in their own right. Because so much about the so much about Mikola that we find in descriptions is often flattering and sympathetic and interesting. But that one description casts a very different shade on kind of all of it. This one. The Empyrean Mikola is loved by many people. Indeed, he has learned very well how to compel such affection. That, that's, that is what sort of plants the seed of distrust in this beloved figure. And now we're actually getting a front row seat to seeing that happen and then seeing that spell cast off, like uh, falling away. And now all these figures who were just sort of following now are finding their own purpose and remembering things and are possibly making different decisions about what to do next. Righteous tarnished. Mikola the kind makes my blood run cold. I am loath to admit it. But even at this very instant, I wish to run very far away indeed. Righteous tarnished. Mikola the kind. I am this, honestly, this twist rules. I love this. And that the twist as to what's happening with these characters, but also seeing this figure react not with anger, but with fear is uh, just all the more cool and makes Mikola all the more interesting and fascinating and makes me want to know more. What is anything different for you? I could see you being completely like nonchalant about all this. I don't feel it. It's broken. Kind Mikola's light is gone, but... I stand tall. Together, we work. Together, for Mikola the kind. No, oh, you're just kind of committed. I like that everyone's kind of... I like that it's not just the simple... Uh, one sort of simplistic way to go with this narratively, with the charm spell removed, would be to have all these characters be angry and kind of turn on Mikola and be swearing vengeance and be wanting to find but like I, I'm sure some of them are going to be like that uh, I like that upon regaining their wits and their will they're all having very different responses and reactions to this and they're all choosing to move forward in different ways it feels much more interesting I don't know what to do our mother abandoned her brood she did not love us we are her children. What should we do? Must we be sad forever? Um, probably not. What if... I don't trust any of these to end happily, but what if you did put it behind you? Mm, maybe that's kindly Mikola's love. Love for all the unloved love to banish the pain. Maybe. Um, do you have more to say? I like finding things for you, Lady Leda. Things bring... Back to business as usual. All right. Works for me. Stay in touch. Goodbye. Uh... If I rest here, how many of you stay put? Both. All right. Huzzah. Um, anything new? Righteous tarnished. No. I am. Um... Will you think on it? Yes. The unloved. Every single one of us. 
can banish our pain forever. Would you mind being more specific? I'm getting a little worried. I like finding things Fine. for you. Things. Goodbye. Mm. All right. Who next? Um. Don't expect much different here, but just in case. Grand, um... How's it going out here? Right, if I could interrupt just real quick. To dance and welcome, oh glorious Sculptor Keeper. What a joy it is to see thee again. Oh, I know. Dost thou hunger, noble guest? Prithee, take with thee more scorpion stew. I've an inkling thou might have need of more. You know, why not? I don't know, like, horn scent seems to be pretty lukewarm on it, but, um, maybe they'll want more. Thank you. All right. Same old, same old here. Let's go check. Let's check on you. I'm very curious what's become of you. All right. Still here. Thoughts. Oh. Um, are you not affected? Even with the spell broken, I'm feeling rather lost. Haunted by memories of St. Trina. Her visage, her sen, the lore of velvety sleep. Would kindly Mikola chasten me for falling for St. Trina, while knowing that she was the discarded half? The problem is, I simply cannot help it. I would sacrifice everything just to gaze upon her one last time. Huh. Same stock here. Do you have more thoughts? I'm feeling rather lost. Haunted by memories. Right, I remember those. Serena. I'm feeling rather hmm. lost, St. Trina. We didn't... I don't think we did. We did not... acquire another of the, um... Teolia concoctions. After the first one we used, right? I don't think we did. No. And maybe that window has closed. I just kind of had a thought. Hmm. Let's rest and see what happens. So, you've had 15 seconds. Feeling better? I'm feeling rather lost. Haunted by memories of St. Trina. I see. Hmm. That's right, we can just buy them. Right, I, I don't know why I thought I had to interact in a different way. I'll have three. It's very expensive. So, you're rich now. What are you going to do with your new wealth? Um, just give me the word if you need any more poison. I see. Well, you don't have to figure it all out at once. Okay. Um. And again, you don't... Leave. Okay, cool. Hmm. Well, before anything else, let's keep checking in with the NPCs what are around. I guess most all of the remaining survivors are all here. Hopefully. So. Big day, huh? How you feeling? Oh, hello. Did you feel it? Mikula the Kind's enchantment appears to have broken. But while my devotion to kindly Mikula remains unchanged, 
by my troth, I am not so sure about the others. No, wait. Perhaps this is a blessing in disguise. I can wield my sword to cull the undeserving. Those unfit to bask in tender Mikula's presence. I should have thought of this earlier. Well, uh, glad you're still feeling positive about all this. Right. It's time to begin ferreting out. Well, hold Those on. Those of us who don't deserve to be at kindly Mikula's side. Uh, yeah, I'm not... No. 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 Don't, don't move. Okay, I'm gonna go talk to this other one. Stay put. So, your thoughts. Intriguing. What remains there to be said? Do you presume us allies even now? Though Mikola's spell is newly broken, I must profess. The spell mattered little. Uphold his covenant, Mikola shall. And in godhood redeem our rueful clan. Then Marika and vilest Erdtree both will at last be from divinity wrenched. And surely, I... Contented, I will be. Well, um, okay. You want some soup? But first, clear resounds the call of vengeance. The Impaler, Mesmer, must pay his due. In vengeance for the flames, my blade I wield. How could I allow myself to forget? Revenge alone assures me peace of mind. That works. I, too, am planning to fight that one eventually. Um... You need anything else? Think not to hinder me upon my path. I wasn't. Lest you, too, wish to face the reckoning. I've been very nice. Don't take this out on me. Think not to hinder me upon my path. Even right now, I am not... turning this mad woman against you. I know, like, I'm not saying that as if that deserves points or is hard to do, I'm just saying. I'm not trying to stand in your path here. Right. It's time to begin ferreting out. Maybe you sleep on this. Who don't Letta. deserve to be a kindly Mikula side. You're going from zero to Inquisition so fast. Please stop. I worry that in making no suggestion, she is going to choose for me or go for both. But, um... I'd rather you didn't go attacking either of them, please. <sighs> Dare I ask what happens if I rest? Still here. Good. No one dead. This one's left, and that's probably for the best. Safest that way. Have you cooled off? Ah, oh, there you are. I've made up my mind. The horn sense will be eliminated. If he were to point his blade at Sir Mesmer or Queen Marika, perhaps it would not matter. But vengeance changes a man. And one day, his blade may turn towards Mikula the kind. Kindly Mikula is, after all, the true golden child. Even if he discards every last drop of his being, his lineage will always remain. He is going for Mesmer, though. So, like... Again, maybe sleep on it? I believe the horn scent suspects what I have in mind. He never placed his full trust in me. Even under the effect of kindly Mikula's spell. He must have recognized something. The scent of the killer that slept within me. The stench of crusted blood. You're going to become a problem, aren't you? I will follow the horn scent. To have his revenge on Sir Mesmer, there is only one place he will go. The Black Keep. And I guess that's where I'm going soon. I will follow the horn scent. To have his revenge Please on be the good. Black Keep. She is definitely not going to. Same thing. I will follow yep. The okay. The black. Well, good talk. 
Of everyone here, I didn't really expect you were going to be the one to become a problem. Though maybe I should have. Oh, now what? Well, um... We have checked in with everyone. I've got a couple of places I want to poke around or go back because folks mentioned me missing a thing there. But, um... I have had a thought. If I'm remembering correctly, this is the one that said, I abandon here my doubt and vacillation. Uh, and the item we got... Which item was it? I think it was this one, the Nectar Blood Burgeon, said to Burgeon Forth where the nectar-like blood of abandoned Trina pooled. Which suggested, because usually we get these Empyrean blood virgins, where the blood of Mikola pools, this one is Trina specifically. So Trina was left down here, somewhere. And especially now that the Great Rune has been discarded, that makes me wonder then if this seal is open now. Because it kind of looks like yes. Yeah, I think the seal was right here. And now we can just go through. To find... Stone Coffin Fisher. These were coffins. Very, very, very big coffins. Wow. Well, this could be a whole thing, and it's been a very eventful day. Let's go ahead and call it. I will see you all tomorrow, and we will explore this next, and... Who knows, man? This stuff is great. I'm loving this. I'll see you all tomorrow for more. Bye!